For some concert venues in Virginia, including one in Norfolk, you'll need more than just your ticket to get in. You'll also need to prove you're vaccinated against COVID-19. Sarah Hammond tells us what you should know before heading to the show. You can see there are lots of shows on the schedule here at the Norva, but now the venue is taking the health of concert goers one step further by requiring proof of vaccination. It's no secret people are ready to get back to seeing their favorite bands in concert. But starting October 1st, you're going to need more than just your ticket. You're also going to need your COVID-19 vaccine card. People like Phil and Nicole Bailey say they're happy about that decision. I feel much more comfortable going to a concert venue knowing the people there are vaccinated than I would otherwise. But for others like Alyssa Siskowski and Cassidy Banzer, they're not thrilled. It's basically you're taking away the right to a freedom in a sense because basically you're you're like forced to basically get it. And it's not just the Norva. The National and the Broadberry in Richmond are requiring the same thing, along with the Kennedy Center in D.C. That's the that's motivation to getting vaccinated, right, is we want to get back to normalcy. That's what we were told. That's the reason why we signed up so quickly to get vaccinated. Like it's... It should be an option. Fest events, which host many outdoor events in the area, has not gone that route yet. Organizers are still just recommending masks for unvaccinated people. However, they say if an artist requires proof of vaccination or a negative COVID test as a condition for admission in the future, they will honor that. Until the Norvis policy goes into effect October 1st, you'll have to either show proof of vaccination or a negative COVID-19 test taken within 72 hours of the concert, and they will accept medical or religious exemptions to the vaccine with proper documentation. In Norfolk, Sarah Hammond, 13 News Now. The Norfolk Waterfront Jazz Festival returns next week. Fest events organizers say if they are forced to move indoors to the Norfolk Scope Arena because of weather, staff will have to wear masks. They say guests, both vaccinated and unvaccinated, should also mask up too.